What's up, guys? It's Jace with Sport Optics here at SHOT Show 2024, and we're at the Collis booth, and we are here to talk with our guy Christian here about one of their newest offerings, the 328i that they have coming out later this year. It's a pretty exciting new product, a cool scope, and we're pretty pumped about it, as always, with anything that Collis comes out with. And I'm pretty much just gonna hand it over to Christian here and let us let him tell us about this cool new scope. Hello, also from my side. I'm really happy that I'm being able today to introduce you our new um, revolutionary new optic, the KR328i. Uh, first focal plane scope, starting magnification three and a half, going up to 28. So as you can see already by the name, a real eight time zoom. And we call it a game changer because with a 40% larger field of view, nice. um, we say this will change your, uh, the complete situation um, when you're shooting in a PRS match, out hunting, and all the other situations which, which you need that kind of uh, optics. Okay, cool. So with this scope where you're kind of targeting uh, a little bit of everybody, you see potential for this to go with the competitive shooter or the hunter. Yeah, that's true. Um, we call this the, some kind of an all-round scope. Uh, beginning with the 50 millimeter objective lens, it's uh, very useful if it comes to the AR-10, AR-15 segment. So the semi-automatic guns, it's ideal uh, to put on clip-ons in the front for night vision. And a positive side effect from the big field of view compared with night vision is also that you do not um, cut the, the display of any night vision. Okay. Um, so this is a really big advantage at the end of the day. And also with uh, magnification starting with a three and a half, mm -hmm. you have a very low starting magnification. And even going up to 28, you have a very high magnification at the end. In comparison to like the K525 that everybody know and loves, yeah. are we having essentially some similar, similar specifications as far as like the parallax adjustment, for instance? Is it the same like minimum yeah. parallax yeah. adjustment? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, the, the 328 came, came with the same um, USBs like I know from the 525. Okay. So first of all, we have a parallax adjustment, which is integrated in the top turret. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is patented by Carlos. Absolutely. And, and this enables us to, that the shooter can choose to have the windage on the left side, on the right side. Mm -hmm. With all the advantages for a right-hand shooter to have the windage on the left side, because then you are able to manipulate um, to work on the scope with your left hand and staying in shooting position behind the rifle with, uh, with your right hand. Okay, awesome. Now, as far as the, um, like the amount of adjustment, is it uh, on, on par with, uh, again, the, the K525? Or um, what, what, what amount of adjustment yeah. are we gonna have in this guy? Adjustment range in that new product, we're having uh, three and a half meters. Okay. So it's uh, half a meter more um, compared to the, to the 525. Wow which okay. is also a big deal for uh, extreme long range competitions and guys Absolutely. who like to shoot on, on, on very long distances. Okay, cool. And when this product comes out, is, gonna, is it going to be available in both MOAs and mills or just mills to start or what? Um, at the moment, we are just planning to, to launch it at the start of delivery in a mill version. Okay. Um, but it will come with two different kinds of turrets, the, the DLR version and the non-DLR version. Um, the non-DLR version do have 160 clicks per rotation mm -hmm. and the small engraving and the DLR version um, is coming with 100 clicks per rotation and a really big engraving which helps you a lot in a stress situation to really fast see um, which kind of clicks you have dialed on your scope okay. and, and be fast in a stress situation. Another great product from Collis that we are super excited to get our hands on. Oh, uh, one more question I just thought of yeah. as far as reticles go? What are we looking at as far as the, the, the first run of reticles yeah. we're going to be seeing? Um, the first run of reticles are the, from us the known uh, Schema 4 and the Schema reticle. Mm -hmm. um, if you take a look at the website, uh, it's called Schema 4 Plus mm -hmm. and Schema Plus. Okay. Um, this is just an indication, also in the reticle name, that something is uh, different compared to the 525. Mm -hmm. So due to the big field of view, we also had to change the reticles a bit. So for example, um, the big lines on the left and right side, we have to move them out. Okay. And they do not disturb your image inside the optics. And also the Christmas tree is uh, going due to the bigger field of view further down. And uh, so these are the main changes in, in the reticles compared to the 525. Okay, awesome. That, I know the uh, Skimmer 4 reticle in particular is 
not only one of Collis's best reticles, but one of the best reticles yeah. in the industry. It's extremely popular. A lot yeah. of people love it. That's true. Yeah. Um, so that, that's exciting. I think that's an excellent route to go. Um, and I think you kind of covered everything there for us. We have now a, a nice general rundown of this scope and just how cool it's going to be. Um, and I know the big question that's going to be on everybody's minds as soon as they see this is, uh, do we kind of have an idea of when this is going to be coming out? Uh, we're planning to have the start of delivery, as we call it, at the beginning of March. Oh, wow. This is the, the actual okay. plan we are working against. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Well, uh, I think that basically gives us everything we need to know. Christian, I sincerely appreciate you taking your time to meet Same with us and, me. and speaking with us. And um, guys, this is, this is going to be another knockout product from Collis. We're very excited to be offering this when it comes out. And uh, stay tuned for more SHOT Show 2024 coverage.